This is the Chitrasena School of Dance, one of the oldest and most prestigious dance schools in the country. Established nearly 75 years ago, at a time when colonialism was threatening to wipe out age-old cultural traditions, this temple of dance is committed to preserving traditional dance forms and passing them on to the next generation. My name is Thaji. I'm the principal dancer of the Chitrasena Dance Company and I'm also a teacher uh, with the Chitrasena School of Dance. I am uh, Guru Chitrasena's youngest granddaughter. Confined to Ceylon's temples and ritual grounds, traditional dancers like the Kandyan dance were nearly extinct when the legendary Chitrasena helped to revive them by bringing them to the stage. Now, three generations later, Thaji is helping to carry on the legacy of her grandfather. This art, which was customarily reserved for men, is now being kept alive and passed on by the women in the family. However, while Kandyan dance is popular in Sri Lanka, the curriculum and methodology in the school is demanding, and not everyone is cut out for its rigors. It's like a meditation basically because uh, you, you have to have the focus to do it, do it right. And doing it right is not just getting a step right or you know doing some kind of choreography right properly. It's, it's your mind, your body, your soul has to be one. And for that you need a lot of self-discipline, basically a lot of focus in your mind. With about 350 students starting from the age of four, the school also has a special one-year scholarship program for those who want to dance professionally. So in that one-year period they learn singing, dancing, drumming, also later on they learn theory and you know so many things and then they become a part of a production then they learn how to put a production together, lighting, costume, stage management. As the third generation of of the family who's continuing this, I feel like we've come back to that age where actually our traditional art forms are slowly um, diminishing and uh, it's kind of the last gurus or last paramparas of each family that are continuing these art forms. For now, however, traditional dance is still safe in the hands of masters like Chitrasena's heirs the foremost of whom is his wife Vajira, who even at the age of 86 is still an indomitable force behind the running of the school.